Hey foodies, let's make a chocolate souffle. These are one of my favorite chocolate desserts. You're gonna love them and they're really easy to make. So let's take a look at the recipe. So you wanna start with some melted chocolate. And I've already got some melted chocolate here. And if you need to melt some good chocolate, you can always melt it on a double boiler, which is a pot of water and then a bowl in on top and you're melting the chocolate. Or the easiest way that I find for melting chocolate is microwave it in a microwave safe bowl in 30 second bursts and stir it every so often and you get some really lovely chocolate. So you wanna start by combining your chocolate and your butter. There we go. And I'm just gonna stir that up until it's well combined. There we go, that's all combined. So I'm just gonna set that aside. And now we're gonna work with our eggs. And I've got two bowls here. So we wanna start with separating our eggs. One. Two. Okay, so we've got our egg yolks and our egg whites separate. And I'm gonna take half of the sugar here, so a quarter cup here and a quarter cup here. And we're gonna beat these. The whites we're gonna beat to a stiff peak and the yolks we're just gonna beat until we get a nice, thick, full look. Okay, so the egg whites are done. Look at those stiff peaks. Oh, they're beautiful. I'm gonna give this a rinse and we'll move on to the egg yolks. Now you can use a stand mixer, but I thought I wanna show that you can use um, beaters or you can use just a hand, uh, a whisk and do this recipe by hand. Look at that color, it's beautiful. Okay, so now it's time to put it all together. So I'm gonna put my chocolate into a bigger bowl. Mmm. This looks yummy already, but I'm a bit of a chocolate fan, so. Okay, so now I want to take some of the egg yolk mixture and I'll put it in and I'm going to fold it in. Beautiful. Okay, a bit more of the egg yolk. And it's important to fold these things in so you keep as much air as you can with the egg. Last of the egg yolk goes in, through, around, through. Okay, now it's on to the egg white mixture and we're doing the same thing again. This one's gonna be a bit stiffer. So around and through. Okay, so I want to take some buttered ramekins. I've already gone ahead and pre-buttered them all. And I'm going to start filling them. 
I think a portion scoop will work the best. And we want to fill them to about two-thirds full. And there we go. These look beautiful so far. So at this point, I can cover them and put them in, in the fridge and they'll last for up to around four days and then we're gonna bake them, or you can just pop them in the bait in the oven and eat them right away. So if this is something for maybe a special day coming up or something like that, you can have them ready the night before, or a couple nights before, and when you're ready to eat them, they take a few minutes in the oven and, but I wanna bake them right now. So I'm gonna put in four for now. We're gonna see what they look like. Look at this chocolate souffle. It's really expanded, it's risen, it's exactly what you want. And I can't wait to dig into it. So let's... Hot, it's supposed to be served hot, which is good. Mmm. Mmm. What's your favorite chocolate dish? I think chocolate souffle is one of my favorites. Let me know in the description in the comments below. I look forward to reading all of your comments. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again soon.